It's not so much the time, it's the anxiety of waiting for results, results, results. You know, like, and that is just worse than anything, just having to wait and wait and wait. Um, there is nowhere uh, close by they go to Townsville, which is quite common, or to Brisbane. All sorts of issues that they're going to have when they suddenly find they have to move out of their community. It's a pretty big deal for them. Their jobs, they probably had to take time off work, all of those things have to come into it. Having something local, that just closes that gap tremendously. Now this sort of thing has got to be a game changer. Whilst, uh, whilst we were able to offer the similar scan, our wait list was quite long. The disruptions meant we couldn't service our patients as quickly as we would like, um, and the wait list at the moment was four to six weeks. Um, by opening up these extra days of scanning and uh, being able to see more patients um, throughout the week, it means we can clear our wait list within the next three weeks and really uh, allow patients who are waiting on that diagnosis and uh, not so much they know that they've got prostate cancer, but really what that looks like in terms of does it mean surgery, does it mean chemotherapy, um, does it mean radiation therapy, and really take that worry away by getting them their results quicker. The big deal here too is the accessibility of this treatment. I've had three of these scans in the past through my uh, prostate cancer journey, um, and there can be quite a significant wait, which is you know, quite an anxious period for a patient um, waiting to find out where their cancer is. Um, being available and being made um, basically at QScan, um, you can have that done much quicker and much more um, efficiently. So I think that's a real improvement in terms of just getting men through these diagnostic tests as quickly as possible um, so that they can then move to treatment, which is what they're desperately wanting. Well, the beauty of it is we're producing it on site now. Prior to today, we had to get it flown in from Melbourne on a daily basis. Okay, The radioactivity only lasts for one day, so every day we have to get a new batch flown in from Melbourne, from the mainland. Which makes it much more efficient, we can do more patients, we can do them any day we like, and um, we get the patients in and it's all ready to go for them. So efficiency for, for patients in Tasmania. 